Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be sort of collabing, not really collabing, but you guys will get to see my day and you guys will get to see Sophie's day, my friend Sophie. I thought it'd be a really interesting video to kind of showcase her day and my day on the same day because she's an architecture student and I'm a business student or commerce student. I'm also very excited to see her day because I don't know what she's going to come up with. It is the first day back for me from a semester break. I don't have class on Monday. Today is Tuesday and so we are starting off with exercise science which is my gen ed and I have a test for that. Um, it's my mid semester test and it's worth 20% of my grade which is like quite a bit so yeah I'm just going to do a bit of study for that and then I have com law from 1 to 2 and then a economics tutorial from 2 to 3 and then yeah that would be my day so it's just three classes morning guys it is currently a uh, tuesday here in wellington so it's got a bit of blue but it's a little bit cloudy um i'm actually doing a conjoint video with wincy today so it's gonna be a day in the life Hey guys, so me and Lily here, we're about to go down for breakfast um, before I have a 9am lecture and then I've got a 10.30am lecture and then a 12.40 lecture, so it's a busy morning. This is my room. Um, I made my own door decorations because I wanted to win a competition but unfortunately didn't quite win. And then we just have our closet on the side which is very messy currently. I'm um, a standard desk and bed and bah. I also have Quizlet downloaded on my phone so you can see like some of the study sets that I've made. This one, this is the most recent one that I made. And yeah, really helpful. Just brushed my teeth and now I'm heading off to my building science class because I study architecture at Victoria University of Wellington. currently walking to my lecture um, it's a lab slash tutorial which happens every Tuesday this is down at the other campus so the campus up that hill there is the main Calburn campus which is where all the people who do BCOMs law and stuff do their work and the one I'm going to is TRO campus which is up here further which you'll soon see and that's where all the art students go and uh, architecture studio classes are there which are big sessions where we do practicals <laughs> Thank you. 
Just finished my tutorial and I submitted everything online. So this is Cuba Street which has got all the food shops and shopping along it. Say hi to the vlog! Starbucks is still here, but I won't get one for you. This is a, um, a vanilla sweet cream cold brew. I've already had my one, so I'm going to pass this one to oh, Ivy. She can have it. And I know you wanted to try this one. Okay, live reaction. Okay. It's so sweet. Yeah. It's very sweet. Do we think that this movement was... Oh. Hi guys, so I actually just got home from uni. It is now like 5.30. Well, I actually just had like an afternoon tea sort of thing. But I didn't film that because um, I kind of forgot. Today's been um, like alright, I guess. I'm um, still sort of trying to get back into routine and everything because obviously it's the first day back um, since the break and yeah so I think I'm just going to do a bit of homework also please don't judge my room like I know it's <clears throat> blue that's because like when I was in year 10 or something like when I was like 15 I loved the color blue like I was obsessed with it and so I just wanted to paint my room blue and so it's blue and I cannot be bothered to paint it back to white Hey guys, so we've just come back from the gym. Um, my phone died, so that's why I didn't record it. Um, and this is not my phone. It's Maya's, lovely Maya over here. Um, and we're walking back to uni to have a shower and then have some dinner because we are quite it's hungry. It is nachos and we're very excited. Very excited. Because nachos are our favorite. Awesome. <laughs> taken me around like an hour an hour and a half to write out all these notes um i finished two readings so these are just some of my notes like the definitions and all of that it is now 6 30 there's a spin class on at seven so i'm just going to get changed now and then go to my spin class now i can tick this off I've just had a shower and now I'm about to go down for some nachos. So cold. Ooh. I'm gonna slide right away down again. So this is our dinner. <laughs> So this is dinner for tonight. I just have some chicken, chickpeas, some broccoli, and some white rice. So we are currently at the supermarket. So I have some good stuff for oh straight, God. but my ass did on the other hand. <laughs> does not. <laughs> but hey, I'll eat her food anyway. <laughs> I just did my business quiz and I got a 5 out of 5, baby! So that is done. Hey guys, so I'm pretty much um, finished for today. So I thought that I might show you an example of one of the pieces of work that I've done as an architecture student. So this project is um, for the course of design processes. So it's pretty much the process you go through to get to the final product. And I studied this semester, I studied three other courses, building science, physics, and design communications. And physics was the tutorial that I went to today. So this is what it looked like. We had to use a already made site 
and change it to make it our own. And then we looked at our precedents, so kind of what makes a park a park and some of the parks that we know. Um, and then I made some photo collages pulling parts that I liked from the precedents. And then I went through and made some clay models and then sketched them out to sort of get a more visual representation. Then I did some practice models on a bison software. And then I made a planting plan. So this was different layers of different plants that I wanted to put in my final plan for the site. And then we had to add in um, section sketches so you could see what it looked like from side on, as well as a site plan and some detailed images as well as a final image that showed what you wanted your design to look like. But yeah, and then over here, this is my bedroom, um, is the final clay model that I actually edited um, to look better. So there was actually a section of today where I didn't quite get everything that I did, um, but what happened is after I left my lecture, I went and did some shopping with my friends um, to get my ball dress, because I have my ball coming up this weekend. And as you can see, it is hanging up over there. Um, so I got a very nice dress from Ruby. I'm probably going to sign off for tonight. I'm probably going to go watch some of The Blacklist, my favourite show. Um, but otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed my day in the life. And I'll potentially see you in some other videos. Peace. So it's now like 10.40. And I've basically finished all my work like I finished everything that I needed to do yeah I'm just really happy because I feel like I'm off to a good start for the second half of the last semester last ever semester of me being a first year and so I really just want to be able to push myself and work really hard the second half of the semester I feel like last semester I didn't do as well as I would have liked and it's not because I didn't try or anything it was just because it was hard for me to adjust to the whole routine of uni and I guess not having like someone telling you what to do. Yeah, please don't judge me, I'm barefaced at the moment and I'm also in my robe because it's the most comfortable thing and this is just how I am every single night. But yeah, um, I think I'm going to sign off here. Thank you for watching up to this point and I hope you guys have enjoyed watching me and Sophie's day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Bye.